Um, flop of the week. Want to go there? Sure. Do you want to go first? You yeah, go because first, it yeah. ties right into my worst team of the week. Nick Hagwood. My goodness. We talked about it when this man resigned. Didn't work in year one. Didn't work well in year two. Didn't work well in year three. All three years, by the way, setting records for the most goals conceded in a single season outside of 2020. We don't, we don't talk about 2020. You bring him back and now are tied for the most goals conceded after playing five games for playing him five games. Are you <laughs> trying to say there's some correlation? Listen, I'm not a PhD mathematician. I'm barely <laughs> an undergraduate mathematician. But I mean, numbers don't lie, people. Numbers just don't lie. I mean, they do if you make them lie, but I'm not making them lie here, I promise. Let's talk about the game. First goal. 1v1 versus Jordy Milovich. Spin cycle. Absolutely spun. No chance of stopping him. Second goal. Didn't close down Kai Kamara. Ball got played in the box. Gave him like four yards of space. He was able to turn, make a pass. Jordy scores a second. Third goal. The line was, he was the last man back on a line that was trying to step. And he was late to recover. He got outrun by Kai Kamara. Yikes. 37. <laughs> My man, hang him up. <laughs> it's over. Um, and then he, he wasn't in on the fourth goal, but all three goals he had something to play in. They've conceded 14 goals in five games. Guys, try something new, please. Well, here's the thing. You can't tell Haglin to hang him up because FCC will just go and bring him back out of retirement. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't like that, but I love it. So Nick Haglin, liability. All right. Go ahead, come my, on, let me yell at you. Yep. My flop of the week is Pedro Gallese. Um, I want to get this in. What'd you say? I don't really hate that. I hate that. No, you it's, it's a different, it's some, it's a game. different, what'd you say? I hate that you picked the player who conceded the most goals again outside of Alec Khan, but you can't pick Alec Khan again. <laughs> I could pick Alec Khan as many times as I want to pick Alec Khan. <laughs> Only for player of the week. All right, so I wanted to get this statement out there. I get it. I pick goalkeeper a lot for this stuff. <laughs> uh, I just think it's a really important position. And I think if you play poorly, it will show because most of the time your team will likely lose if you play poorly enough. And boy, did Gaiese not play well in this game. I've never been a big fan of Gaiese. I'm going to say that now. I always, I've always thought he was a bit overrated. So what? I'm, You're I'm taking mine. No, nope. so I'm taking my chance here to dunk on him. Four goals conceded. Granted, it, it's a strong LAFC team, but he made zero saves the entire game, and one punch. I, I get it. LAFC strong. I get it. He's not at fault for every single goal, but it still doesn't look good when you concede four goals and you make zero saves. Um. To give a little bit of context on as to whether or not the goals were like super easy to save or if they were like just kind of tap-ins. Um, I know that there were a few that were out of his control. But going back to my favorite stat, got to bring it up any chance that I can. The post-shot expected goals plus minus. That's a mouthful. For Pedro Gaese for that last game was a minus 1.1. So based on that statistic, basically – he gave up one extra goal over what he was expected to. Again, it's a it's a subjective st statistic, but it's one that I, I like to go to to just try to get a sense of whether or not the goalkeeper was pretty much like hung out to dry. So based on that, not a great game from him. I'm sure he will bounce back. He will not be in this spot. He may not be in this spot for the rest of the season, honestly, but I'm taking my chance to dunk on him here. I feel like we've done a disservice not talking about Alexander Pato being amazing, um, but alas. Well, that's 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 your agenda. That's that's your job. We uh, have hype train people that are assigned to us. That's one of yours. You got to do your job. <laughs> I should have, right? I mean, so here's the thing: he scored two, but one of them got called back. If uh, yeah, Facundo Torres stayed on side. Yeah, it was close. He, uh, 
what would you say if you um if you get that second goal sorry i got i got distracted for a second if you score that second goal he's my player of the week by like miles like chicharito mihailovic not even spoken about like gone 